Here's a very fun weather little game you can play. I've made these, I just drew them on cardboard. It's a little picture of each season. Sorry, not weather game, it's a seasons game. Here's winter, we talk about it, the different seasons and what happens in the seasons. We read books about the seasons and then we play this little game. Here's spr spring, summer, autumn, and winter. And what you can do, you can um, photocopy these pages or what I thought of doing is putting them inside a clear um, plastic folder and they can color it with crayons or marker. That way you can reuse them for other children. So before we start, we get to do some coloring and we also write at the top different seasons or you can also make some flashcards with spring, summer, autumn, or fall and winter and they have to place it on the right picture. Then the next thing of our game, I have here some little people. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're gonna sort these out. We're gonna put all the little heads. So there's one child for each season. You can tell them that. Just drew little kids and a different little hat. And then here are their bodies of their tops and then we have their pants okay, these are not in any particular order as you can see anyway what we do is we this is how we play we roll the dice we decide beforehand um, which number is for which season. You can pick one for spring, two for summer, three for fall, four for winter, or something like that. And we roll the dice. Whoever starts and la whatever it lands on, is it a spring, summer, autumn, or winter, you get to pick which one you want, or the right one. For example, if you fall on summer, you look, you start with the head. You find the little summer head. Oh, here, he must be, he wears a sun hat. And you put it on top of your summer picture. And then you roll the dice, and if you get the feet, or the body, or the his um, pants, anyway, you work on matching your little summer boy. Mm, he'll wear a bathing suit. And then kind of shoes. Oh, these are water shoes. He likes to go play at the beach so he can wear his water shoes. And there's our summer little boy. And then, so each child picks a different one, a different paper. Spring, summer, fall, or winter, and they have to build their little child. It takes a little while if you have four people. If you have two kids, you can, you can, um, they can each have two. Anyway, so it's like they're making their little person. And you can talk about the different clothes that they wear in which season. Here's a little girl in winter. She needs a woolen hat, a woolen scarf to keep warm, a big warm jacket. She even needs to wear some mittens, nice warm pants, and some big snow boots to keep warm. And then you find the other. Here's our spring. Sorry, our, yeah, here's our spring little boy. Now, spring, you can talk about, it's still a little bit cold. Actually, sorry, here, he's in autumn. It's a little bit cold and windy. It's also when the kids go back to school. He's going to back to his football team play football. So there's our little boy. He still wears long pants and a warm sweater because it gets kind of windy in autumn. And here's our little spring girl. Now what is she doing? She has a watering can. She wears a nice little cool skirt, little slippers. It's warm in spring. And you can help water your plants, take care of your garden so your flowers can grow. 
Anyway, so that's a fun little game you can play or that you can make.